This is News on 6 Sports with Bobby Lewis. Shane Hammond is spending the next 17 days in New York City, but it's no vacation. The Oklahoma native will be calling part of the Olympics on TV, representing his country again, this time through a microphone. I believe that was the 2004 National Championships. And that was 190 kilos, which is 418 pounds. At one time, Shane Hammond had the weight of the world on his shoulders. The strongest man in America competed in two Olympic Games, 2000 in Sydney, Australia, and 2004 in Athens, Greece, representing his country and his home state of Oklahoma. Easy jerk overhead, 473 pounds. Especially at my first Olympic Games in 2000, I was really, really nervous. Whenever I started thinking about having all this support in this country, you know, and especially the state of Oklahoma was really backing me too, I had so many letters from kids. To me, the pride of knowing that, that I had that much support really got me through. Seven years after retiring from the sport, he's lifting less weight, but carrying more responsibility. It's been busy because at work, I've been having to work a lot of extra time so I could take off 17 days to go to the Olympics. Busy time for me right now, but it's exciting too. Every four years, this world record holder from Mustang, Oklahoma, gets the Olympic itch. And this summer, he'll be back in the action. And with that lift, he just set a couple of American records. Calling the weightlifting portion of the games for the second time on TV. I had a lot of fun announcing in 08. I got to watch every lift of the Olympics for weightlifting, for one thing. And that, to me, was just a lot of fun. And to get there and just be able to call it call it as I saw it and tell people what this weight amounts to and I love comparing what people are listening to to like everyday things like refrigerators or or animals you know and that's one thing you can look for if you watch me on there I didn't think they'd call me back but they called me back and they wanted me back so apparently somebody liked it his upstairs game room proves he's got the credentials and the authority to explain each lift but he wants Olympic viewers to see him as just another guy a proud red, white, and blue-blooded fan. I always think maybe I want to just sit at home on my TV and watch the games, you know, like everybody else does. But I think being involved, it really is It's pretty special to be able to be part of it. He owns the world record for the heaviest squat, 1,008 <laughs> pounds. You've got to be Up and down. Yeah, pretty impressive. But that little baby boy's nothing then. Yeah. It? <laughs> very easy, like bread. Yeah, it's maybe the best way. follow in his father's footsteps. Maybe. All right, thanks a lot. We'll be right back.